In today's gospel, Jesus tells a parable, one of the most famous parables, the story of the Good Samaritan. Hello, I'm Father James Kabicki, and I'd like to share with you today something that Pope Benedict said last March to a group of volunteers in Italy. He was encouraging them in their efforts to help others and reminded them of something he said in his encyclical, God is Love, where he said the following, Love will always prove necessary, even in the most just society. There is no ordering of the state so just that it can eliminate the need for a service of love. Then, in his talk to volunteers, he went on to say, For this very reason, volunteers are not stopgaps in the social network, but people who truly contribute to tracing society's human and Christian features. Dear friends, your commitment is a service to the dignity of the human beings founded on their having been created in God's image and likeness. As the episode of the Good Samaritan has shown us, sometimes seeing can turn to emptiness or even contempt, but a gaze can also express love. You are living icons of the Good Samaritan, attentive to your neighbor, remembering human dignity and inspiring hope. When a person does not limit himself to doing no more than his professional or family duties require, but seeks to help others, his heart expands. Those who love and freely serve others as their neighbor live and act in accordance with the gospel and take part in the mission of the church that always looks at the whole person and wants him to feel God's love. So if you're a volunteer, know that the Pope supports you. And if you aren't giving even a little in volunteer work, why not consider following the example of the Good Samaritan?